Hello, I'm Ross Monson. I'm the refit manager at Berthon, and um, this is the Aglaia project behind me that we've just done a full restoration on. When the vessel got here, we did a survey of the rigging, and it was found there was some very serious structural damage to the rods uh, and the standing rigging. Obviously, from that, we did a report, and it had to be. There was no question; it had to be replaced. Um, it had been up for 15 years, and it was time to move on. Um, we worked very closely with Marine Results, um, a company who do NDT testing, um, and they helped us come up with a solution to um, refit new rod rigging to the vessel. Um, obviously we changed all the fittings, we took the rigs to apart completely, every single component came off the rigs. We refitted new stainless steel screws and bolts into it, upgraded the bolts to make sure it was safe. We shot blasted the rig and repainted all the surfaces and coatings to make sure they last for another 15 years. Um, and also we supplied a very bespoke running rigging package which was colour matched for the owner. He specifically chose a colour which the whole theme of the boat was. Um, and we, we basically spliced all this in-house, set it all up in-house so that every single line was exactly the same colour um, but very specifically designed to do the job it was meant to do. Um, so the rigging team here at Berthon took that on, stripped the whole thing, took it apart. Marine Results supplied the rod and we fitted it. Um, and obviously with a rig there were some very custom components that we had to, to fit and, and work very closely with Marine Results to make it a reality. Within two hours the rig was out of the boat. Within two hours of being set up the rig was in the boat. Um, the team here know exactly what they're doing. Part of the problems with an 80 foot boat is there's usually a lot of interior around the mast and it's making sure nothing gets scratched or damaged on the way in and that the process is safe not only for the people working on it but also for the um, for the rig to make sure the rig doesn't get damaged as it is a very crucial part of the yacht. So the um, mast stepping of glass, one of the features of certainly the larger yachts and the 80 footers and above is that the rigs are a large part are integrated into the systems of the boat. The, the diesel ventilate tank ventilation, the air ventilation, um, a lot of that runs up the rig. There's a lot of venting through the rig. The guys have to make sure firstly that's disconnected, obviously that everything's safe. Um, also getting a lot of the interior, usually in these boats, to hide the rig. There's a lot of interior built around them, which is obviously varnished and in a lot of cases highly bespoke and that we've got to get it out of the rig out of the boat without damaging anything firstly. Uh, we've also got to make sure the rig doesn't get damaged in the process. Uh, obviously the boat doesn't get damaged in the process and obviously that we're following safe guidelines to get it out. Um, the team here are very quick, very efficient. They can do a number of big rigs in a day. We're fully set up for it. Um, but it's also just taking the time and the care to make sure nothing gets damaged in the process. Because again, once the rig's in, um, we, you only get to do the job once.